everybody, and welcome to NHK's Radio English Conversation Program. I'm Marsha Krakauer. And this is Jeff Clark. Let's enjoy learning English together. Hi, so let's listen to First Day in a New Position. Lee's fixing a special dinner for her mother when Judy arrives. These croissants look divine, Judy. Where did you find them? My former landlady owns and manages a bakery. She runs a bakery and an apartment house? Katie Min is quite an entrepreneur. She was penniless when she came from Vietnam 25 years ago. You know, my mom's a self made person like that, too. In what respect is she self made? Well, after Dad passed away, She went right out and got a job. And she's worked her way up the corporate ladder. And we're here to celebrate her latest promotion. Would you see what my kid brother's doing right now? Looks like he's watching a kung fu movie. As usual. Jason, I thought I told you to have the table set before Mom got home. Anything you say, Sergeant. Hustle, boy. You'd think one day out of the year he'd do his chores without being told. It's just a developmental stage, Lee. One thing's for sure he'd be fired if he were working with Mom. Carrie Parker enters the kitchen. Did I hear somebody say my name? Mom, I didn't hear you come in. Hi, Carrie. Oh, Judy. Good to see you. Look at this feast, will you? Who is this all for? For you, Mom. To celebrate your first day as senior manager. Yeah, Mom. We've even baked your favorite chocolate cake. Well, this is a welcome sight to come home to. Boy, it's been budget battles and office politics all day. Shall we sit down to eat? Let me first change out of this power suit. Over dinner, they talk about Carrie's first day in her new position. I thought there was equal opportunity in advertising. It's better than most businesses. But the glass ceiling is there. Mom's the first woman to be head of publicity. A lot depends on the company and on your immediate boss. So, how did everybody treat you today? I got congratulated, taken out to lunch. It was. Jason, please don't reach like that. Sorry. As I was saying, everyone was nice, but they're waiting to test me. You know, see if I can handle the authority. If anyone needs proof, just have them call me, Mom. Okay, then let's go on to the first part vocabulary. Croissant. Divine. Former. Landlady. Run. Entrepreneur. Penniless. Self made person. Pass away. Go right out. Work one's way up. Corporate ladder. Promotion. Okay, then please listen to the first part. Lee's fixing a special dinner for her mother when Judy arrives. These croissants look divine, Judy. Where did you find them? My former landlady owns and manages a bakery. She runs a bakery and an apartment house? Katie Min is quite an entrepreneur. She was penniless when she came from Vietnam 25 years ago. You know, my mom's a self made person like that, too. In what respect is she self made? Well, after Dad passed away, she went right out and got a job. And she's worked her way up the corporate ladder. And we're here to celebrate her latest promotion. Now, please repeat line by line. These croissants look divine, Judy. Where did you find them? My former landlady owns and manages a bakery. She runs a bakery and an apartment house? Katie Min is quite an entrepreneur. 
She was penniless when she came from Vietnam 25 years ago. You know, my mom's a self-made person like that, too. In what respect is she self-made? Well, after Dad passed away, she went right out and got a job. And she's worked her way up the corporate ladder. And we're here to celebrate her latest promotion. Good. Then let's go on to the key expressions. Number one. In what respect is she self-made? どういうふうに自力で成功した人なの In what respect is 誰々何々これは誰々はどういうふうに、まあ、どんな点で何々なんですかということです。相手の言ったことをもう少し具体的に知りたいときに使う表現です。この respect は point, 点 detail, 詳細の意味で respect, 尊敬の方ではございません。exercise one, one. どんな点でその仕事は大変なんですか ?In what respect is the work demanding? Two. どういうふうに経済が好転しているんですか ?In what respect is the economy improving?Key expression number two. We're here to celebrate her latest promotion. 彼女の今回の昇進をお祝いするためにここに集まったんです。We're here to 何々。私たちは何々するためにここに来ました。集まりました。は、訪問や集まりの目的を伝えるときに便利な表現です。パーティーの会場などで少し改まって使う表現でもあります。Exercise 2, 1. 私どもの最新モデルをご紹介するためにこちらへ伺いました。We're here to introduce our latest model.2. 人口危機について話し合うためにここに集まりました。We're here to discuss the population crisis. Well, that's all the time we have for today. I'm Marsha Krakauer. And this is Jeff Clark saying, join, join us, us tomorrow. tomorrow.